would have thought today, out of all days, uh, with CS2's launch and a uh, sporadic double upload, I was pretty much reminded of something that happened to me that was kind of fucked up and I wasn't going to talk about it because I had respect for these people. So as you guys know, with CS2 out, a lot of service providers or cheap providers, you can say, are uh, coming to me, obviously, for, you know... Uh, promo and stuff like that. And I figured I would uh, I would accept some of these, but I wanted to touch on something that actually, rightfully so, I believe, pissed me off. Some of you guys would know that Cartel Cheats resold Satan 5 Cheats for a very long time. We got such a good deal on it that we resold for the exact same price as Satan 5 did, but offered more payment methods. As of today, Satan 5 hit me up. And for those unaware, Virtus Spawns is the... Uh, is the owner of Satan 5. He hit me up today and said, hey, how are you? I replied back with, yo. He replies back and says, soon we will have EFT and Rust back up within one to two weeks. And I also wanted to ask you if you can include your next video, maybe our CS2 cheat. Uh, it's free for a week. At the moment, only visuals and aimbot will come sooner. And he says, I can give you a better deal next time you buy keys. Next time you buy keys. I replied back with, I'm not gonna lie, brother. You have 800 euros of my money from the other cheats that didn't get worked on. Now, to further explain this, we bought 800 dollars, 800 euros, not even dollars, 800 euros, which uh, it doesn't matter for most people. 800 euro is 1135 Canadian dollars, my currency. That's not a little amount of money. He goes, you mean open keys. So to further go into this, we bought the keys and about a week after buying the keys, every single cheat at Satan 5 shut down because the coder left. He never refunded me. He never offered to refund me. He kept on feeding me bullshit about the cheats being updated, telling me one week, two weeks, a month, we're working on them right now. I asked for a refund. He told me it was not possible. He says, you mean open keys. I said, they were all down for a year, brother. Notice this is a year later. I'm making this video a year later because of the shit that he said in this conversation. And I want to warn all resellers and anybody that's looking to get partnered with Satan 5 for CS2, you need to see this video because this is what happens. This is another midnight situation, except it happened directly with me. So I know everything I need to know. And I can tell you from my own personal experience. He goes, you know, you're not alone, but give me two weeks max and you can sell them again. Does this mean that more than just me were basically scammed out of their keys as well? I said, that doesn't matter though. Not once did you try to fix the issue or at least compensate me with half the value. All promos paid promo on my channel. He says, how much? I said, I don't sell cheats anymore, just do media. He says, you want for promo because half of the refund I don't think I can do after a year. Maybe in the beginning when it was down for two weeks. I said, videos are 275 pre-roll ads, 140 for two. He goes, but since I know cheats will come back, it makes no sense to refund you. But you can understand why me being a little messed up trust-wise makes sense. I asked you for a refund the same week they went down. Scroll up. So you cannot say that. To say that he would have refunded me because it made sense a week or two after they had been down is a complete fucking lie. Because I asked. And he did not give me a refund. He told me, no, the cheats will be worked on. Just told him. I said, I don't sell cheats anymore. Like, that doesn't help me. He goes, no one refunds when cheats go down. It's like the ABC of cheat providers. First of all, if a cheat is down, you shouldn't be selling it. And second of all, if a cheat is down, you come and tell me. He never told me. I had to find out by selling to a customer and figuring out it was fucking detected. And guess what? Because it was detected, we fucking refunded like a proper cheat provider. I said as well, if a cheat is down for more than a detection, I have always refunded. And so do all resellers I've worked with. I don't know what cheap providers are acting like the ABC of cheap providers is never to refund. I said it costs nothing to refund for something that costs you zero dollars. For him to generate keys costs him no fucking money. He's already got my money. He goes, I know different and I've been here a long time. So have I. I've been in the cheating scene since 2014. The fuck do you mean? Are, like, what do you mean you've been here a long time? You have one site. I've owned four. And on top of that, I've promoted and worked with resellers like more, 100% more than anything, which pisses me off about this is I promoted Satan 5's EFT like fucking crazy. I did them a free CSGO video because they treated me so well by giving me EFT subscriptions for free. This is why it's so annoying because it's like they worked their little fucking claws into my back and then fucked me over. He said it has nothing to do with greed. 
I said, I'm just saying to basically fuck me out of 800 euros and then come ask me to do promo for your site is kind of fucked up. You told me countless times no refunds not possible, then told me one month fixed, etc. It's been a year. He goes, that's life. So many things happen during the year. Couldn't see it coming. I said, that's a shitty fucking excuse. He said, I didn't fuck you out of 800 euros. You wanted keys. You got it. I wanted working keys. Keys for cheats that my subs and viewers and uh, like customers could buy that actually worked. You had a reputation to uphold and you threw it in the fucking dirt over 800 euro. I said, the keys didn't work. It's fine. You know what? Never mind. He said, soon you can resell. I don't sell cheats as stated. That time is over. He said, sell it to someone else. I said, I cannot in good faith recommend your site to any other reseller. Just simply off my own experiences working with you. And for all I know, they'll get fucked too. I've never even brought this issue up publicly either because I'm not trying to get into drama, but what he is saying and the attitude he is presenting this with has made me actually fucking pissed off. There's thousands of hate videos. Well, maybe not that many, but hundreds of hate videos on me and those don't really bother me. What bothers me is the, uh, the actual lack of frontal lobe in this motherfucker's brain talking right now. Even if he had paid me to promote his CS2 cheat, I would still have to bring this up as I was reminded of it because it does not feel right to be like, oh, okay, pay me 275. Let me promo this fucking cheat. And then boom, everyone thinks Satan five is cool. I recommend Satan five to real dude Zinc. Real dude Zinc starts selling real dude Zinc is now fucked out of keys. I can't knowingly do that, knowing what has happened in my own personal experience. He said, I'm looking now. I think most of the keys that are not working anymore or you didn't sell. I said, I took them down when you stopped replying to me about the cheats being fixed. He goes, I didn't reply because nothing was new. I said, that's horrible communication. He said, that's normal. I said, simply be a man and say, nothing is fixed, not sure. You saying this makes you look like a scammer, brushing it off like it's not a big fucking deal. He said, it's not a big deal. I said, you know what? Don't worry, this entire convo reminded me I'll be doing a video, but just not to promo you. He goes, other resellers contacted me and I tell them what's going on. So you want to make a video about what? And I just said simply exactly what I'm saying now. I work with some of the largest resellers and a lot of creators follow my channel, even the haters, because if you hate me, but still watch me, you're a fan in denial. Before they decide to resell you, uh, for you or work with you, I'll let them see this whole convo. I've already got it recorded and I'll let them know what happens when they buy keys from you and your cheats don't get updated. Let them decide. Fuck with my money, I'll fuck with your money. He said, no problem, go for it. You'll hit a wall with the video. I said, you think you scare me? My fucking docs is public. The fuck are you gonna do? G do it, like it hasn't already been done. And he said, are you an idiot? He said, I'm not scaring you. Do I look like I wanna scare someone? He's saying it will have no effect. We don't scam people and everybody knows that. Well, it kinda sucks that every single thing you just said is now available for anybody that types in Satan5 on YouTube to see. I kind of hate that I even had to bring this up after a year. I kind of hugged the bullet of being out $1,100. But at the end of the day, I'm not letting this guy come back now that he has the chance with a new game out to make a bunch of money off of resellers, etc. Because I can almost guarantee if that cheat goes down and it doesn't get updates, tons of you fuckers will be out of accounts, will be out on keys. And at the end of the day, I'm not fucking dealing with it. Take it as it is. You decide whether or not you want to work with Satan 5 or use their cheats. At the end of the day, uh, I can't trust somebody that has literally just said what they said. I'm at the point where it's just fucked up, man.